Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a really quick and easy pressure cooker chilli. So uses a handful of kitchen cupboard ingredients, really quick to make using this. So what I've got in here is I've done the veg already. So I've got some onions, some chilies, and tomatoes, preferably chunky as we're using a pressure cooker. Just some pork mince and then I've got our ingredients of some kidney beans and chilli, some cumin seeds, some garlic pepper some smoked paprika, some celery salt, some liquid smoke, some crust chilies, some oregano and a little bit of MSG. And this is our pressure cooker. Really good product, the Pressure King Pro. Just makes cooking so much easier. So I'm literally going to show you how easy it is to knock a chilli up. So literally whack the fry button on which warms it up. Then literally, a bit of olive oil in. Break up the pork mince, like so. We start adding our herbs and spices. Then all of this is done to taste. So what you want to do is add, start with your paprika, you want a couple of tablespoons of that. Tablespoon of oregano. I like mine quite spicy, so some couple of tablespoons of crust chili, some liquid smoke. Really gives it a nice meaty flavour. Little bit of celery salt. In with your garlic pepper. In with your cumin seeds. About a tablespoon of them. Take the lid off that one. So, then some vegetables. There we go. Right now, so this has been frying for about five minutes, so it's all browned nicely. And then what you literally do, simply add your chili beans. Add the passata. Okay, so now the kidney beans and the passata have been stirred in, nearly ready to pressure cook. So what I'm going to do is, to give it a bit of extra flavour, though it's not Mexican, I'm going to add a touch of uh, Chinese cooking wine to really bring out the flavour. So this stuff you can get it, it's pretty multi-use and, it, and it's really good stuff. So then quite simply, once that's all done, bubbly nicely, close the lid down. Lock it in place. Make sure your valve is set to lock. Then press pressure cook, which is that one. So cancel the fry first. Set your time. So I would do this for about 35 minutes. And done. And what we do is we come back when this is uh, cooked and ready to serve. So now our chilli's done, so what I'm going to do is turn it off and release the steam valve. So yeah, after you release the steam and open the lid, here you have it, your chilli is done. Okay, so the million dollar question is though, is this chilli any good? And the answer is, mm, really nice there, so you get the meatiness from the pork and the liquid smoke, you get the heat from the... Uh, the fresh chilies, the crust chilies, and the chili sauce. Get the earthiness from the paprika, and um, add in that rice wine. Although, you know, if you can get it, really elevates the dish. Thoroughly recommend it. You know, really easy to make. You can mix and match it, so you can use any mince. You can use vegetables. You know, you can use tofu, soy mince, whatever you got on hand, really. Um, I know, there's one thing I love about chilli, so versatile, keeps for a few days as well, so this will be lunch for the next few days. So anyway, I hope you like this video, please like and subscribe for future videos.